Chapter 1 Gravitation Revision We perform many activities in our day-to-day -day life for which we apply force. For example, lifting a book, cycling, hammering a nail into a wall, climbing a staircase, etc. In all these examples, force is being exerted. There are various effects of a force acting on a body. A force can set a stationary body in motion. A force can change the speed of the body. It can change the direction of motion of the body. A force can change the speed as well as the direction of motion of the body. A force can change the shape and size of the body on which it acts. In the previous grade, we have studied different types of forces. Muscular force, mechanical force, gravitational force, magnetic force, frictional force, electrostatic force are the various types of forces. Out of all these types of forces, we are going to study gravitational force in detail. Come then, let us begin with it. If a ball is thrown upwards by applying force, it reaches a certain height and comes down again. When fruits of trees ripen, they fall down. This happens because the earth pulls all the objects towards itself. We know that the force applied by the earth to pull objects towards itself is called gravitational force and that the earth's gravitational force acts on every object. In the previous grade, we have learned that gravitational force is a universal force and it acts not only between two objects on the earth but also between two objects in the universe. Come, let us now understand how this force was discovered. 